Day 1 of the iconic Rolling Loud Festival finally made its electrifying return to Miami on Friday night. Day 1 of the iconic festival saw some of the biggest names take to the stage, including some huge surprises. But day one wasn't without its drama. Friday's headliner Kid Cudi threw his mic on the ground before screaming at fans and storming off the stage after being pelted with items thrown by audience members. Video footage shared on Twitter initially showed the pursuit of happiness rapper being hit in the face with water bottles during his set. He then threatened festival goers saying he would cut his set short if they continued to disrespect him. I will effing leave. If I get hit with one more effing thing, if I see one more effing thing on this effing stage, I'm leaving, he told the crowd. Don't eff with me. He was then hit with another water bottle from the crowd member, which caused Cuddy to drop his mic on the ground and storm off the stage. Fans then began chanting Kanye West's name. Aside from the drama, the festival did have a special surprise in store for the night. During Lil Durk's set, none other than rapper Kanye West made a brief appearance on the stage. Needless to say, it was music to everyone's ears. Literally. West's appearance at the festival was surprising to many, especially since he dropped off the lineup less than a week ago. Cuddy was ultimately chosen to replace West as Friday's headliner. During his brief appearance on stage, West performed his hit song Father Stretch My Hands, part one from his The Life of Pablo album. Fans were quick to note the song's vocals were recorded by Cuddy. It seems as though the song choice was adding insult to injury, as West and Cuddy had a very public falling out earlier this year. West slammed Cuddy for being friends with comedian Pete Davidson, who is currently dating West's ex-wife Kim Kardashian. Just so everyone knows Cuddy will not be on Donda because he's friends with you know who, West wrote in a now deleted Instagram post. Cuddy then responded to West on Twitter, calling the rapper a dinosaur and accused him of lying. God opens the door so the wrong people can exit your life. Cuddy tweeted in response. Day One also saw Saweetie take to the stage. She performed her hit tracks My Type and Best Friend and even teased a new song that will be out soon. Playboy Cardi and ASAP Ferg also sent the crowd wild with their sets. Day 2 is set to be just as iconic. Future is set to take to the main stage last as the night's headlining act. With Lil Uzi Vert, DaBaby, and Gucci Mane all set to give amped up performances. Saturday will also see City Girls take to the stage, as well as Soulja Boy.
Kendrick Lamar will cap the festival off as the headlining act on Sunday. His performance will come after Lil Baby, Kodak Black, and Baby Kim take to the stage, 